in Young's double slit experiment, monochromatic light is used. Okay, so let's have one millimeter apart. C and D is one millimeter. Screen is one meter distance away. This is one meter. Distance from the center of the screen where the intensity becomes half of the maximum intensity. So what is going to be the maximum intensity? This is four I naught is going to be the maximum intensity. So half of it. So I becomes actually two I naught. So therefore we can clearly see that cos square phi by two is equal to one by two. So therefore cos of phi by two is equal to 1 by root 2 so therefore 5 by 2 is equal to uh, pi by 4 okay so therefore 5 is equal to pi by 2 okay so now this is equal to 2 pi by uh, okay so this 5 is equal to uh, pi by 2 so therefore we have 2 pi by lambda into delta x is equal to pi by 2 gone gone so delta x should be equal to lambda by 4 now what is delta x so this is the delta x this is going to be equal to lambda by 4 okay so uh, if th this is D so therefore uh, you know like this is also theta so this is 90 minus theta so this becomes theta so this is D cos theta and this is D sine theta this this is D sine theta so therefore d sine theta is delta x <coughs> so d sine theta is equal to delta x now since theta is small so therefore we'll take sine theta as tan theta so therefore into d into y by d is equal to lambda by 4 so therefore y becomes lambda by 4 into capital d by small d which is equal to now these are everything okay so lambda by 4 which is 5000 into 10 to the power minus 10 meters by 4 into capital D which is 1 meter divided by a uh, small d which is 10 to the power minus 3 meters so this becomes um, goes up so this is 5 into 10 to the power is minus 10 this goes this goes is minus 6 minus 3 to plus 6 so this is minus 4 divided by 4 so this is equal to 500 divided by 4 into 10 to the power minus 6 so therefore it is 125 into 10 to the power minus 6 meters so therefore 125 is the answer thank you so what we did is what we did is very simple First, we kind of you know uh, we first we understood what is the formula for the intensity then we put here 2 i naught which is going to be the half of the maximum intensity okay so uh, by doing this cos 5 by 2 okay the cos 5 by 2 becomes 1 by root 2 so therefore we understood what is going to be the, be the delta uh, phi okay that is the phase angle difference so the phase angle difference comes out to be pi by 2 so now corresponding to this phase angle difference what is going to be the path difference lambda by 4 now this lambda by 4 this is lambda by 4 this delta x is lambda by 4 so this is equal to d sine theta now since sine theta is equal to tan theta because it's a small angle so therefore we have this equation so d d d into tan theta y by d is equal to lambda by 4 and this we can calculate the y from.